Grandpa Newby reporting for duty with an incredible story here. I think at the end of life cycle, Activision, Sledgehammer, they've given us a new meta weapon. And I am not kidding. No clickbait. This weapon competes for meta. And let's have a look at it. It's the cast off LSW. First of all, how do we get it to Interstellar? I'll go over that because it's not that difficult. For the all consuming camo, we just need level 350 kills. And that's very easy to get to level 3 because you have double weapon XP right now and probably will through the weekend. They've given out double XP, all three of them, like Halloween candy. The next one, finger traps. Oh, look at there. I expect to see a Chinese finger trap, but I really don't see one. Those are pretty fun puzzles. I don't know. Do they still exist? Comment below. You have to get to level A. You'll do that in the first or second game. And then you need 10 operator penetration kills. This is the hardest one for me to get. When you're looking for penetration kills, you can never get them. When you're not looking for them, they show up all the time. And then level 12, get 10 operator kills with full attachments. That's like going to bed at night. Easy. Then finally, get 10 operator double kills with a cast off again. Pretty easy. Once you get gilded, or to get to gilded, you need 10 operator full auto clean kills. That's kills without bleeding. Don't get blood on the weapon. For forge, 25 operator kills while moving. And then priceless is two kills without releasing the trigger 25 times. Now, it's not double kills. It's just two kills without releasing the trigger 25 times. You might consider the 150 round mag for this one, but it was easy. only took a couple of games. And once you have priceless, Interstellar comes for free. Let's have a look at the configuration that I think is the best. And I'm going to tell you something. This weapon, you know, Grandpa doesn't like tax stance. This weapon is a tax stance king. Yes, an LMG is the best tax stance weapon I can think of because you can reach out and gack somebody. Send them your very best in 50 caliber rounds. First of all, we go with the paracord grip. All green, all green, no red. Now, you can look for further tax stance improvements, but once you get to 1.6 degrees per second, get on with it. I mean, think about something else. This is pinpoint accurate and pinpoint accurate at distance so i want the ads movement speed it's at 3.1 meters per second and that's for an lmg i want the sprint to fire speed and i want the horizontal recoil handle the bombast t54 short barrel helps 20 percent with the tax stance the rest of it mobility green handling ads speed sprint to fire for an lmg is now at 24 percent better 71 milliseconds we're talking about an LMG sprinting to fire, transitioning as fast as most handguns. Yeah, it hurts the recoil, but you're not going to notice the recoil. The Razor Hawk laser helps the tax stance by 20%, the sprint to fire speed 32 full percent, and the ADS 8%. Now, some of my friends said, oh, it's a beautiful weapon. You'll do fine with it without a laser. But you know what? This time, I'm willing to show the enemy where I am because if they get anywhere close to me, they're getting gacked by this tax stance setup. And now we're going no stock and that helps with the sprint to fire speed. Look at that, 32% better. We've loaded this thing up to be evasive, to be fast, to get bullets in the air quickly, and to be able 24% better on the tax stance spread. I mean, where can you go wrong? Well, one place where we can go is the shooting range. And you can see that small spread there. You just obliterate people. And you have 100 rounds to obliterate people. That is absolutely amazing. 150 if you want to go with the 150 round mag. I chose not to, but it's definitely an option. So let's take the cast off LSW, the new meta in tactical stance, maybe, onto the field of honor. See how it did for Grandpa. See what it did to Grandpa's shocked and amazed enemies. Let's go. Before we get to work, let's look at the damage. 42 to the head, 36, 33, 33. We have 800 rounds per minute rate of fire. We're talking SMG-like fast SMG like effective damage range reaches out to 30.5 at 800 meters per second bullet velocity 
hit scan range 40 meters almost well it's 10 meters beyond the effective damage range so things are looking really good don't forget to put her in tax stance first time out of the box success grandpa sneaking around like sneaky snake there do you know that sneaky snake drinks root beer that was one of my kids I don't know, like Sesame Street or something like that. Uh, Grandpa's taking hits and it's a Muppet. A Muppet with an ant face. So Grandpa's going back to find that Muppet. Boom. Call that tax stomping, not tax stancing. You can tax stomp people with this weapon. There's another Muppet in the tactical cocktail wear. You can move really fast. The 7.5, I think it was, is the tactical sprint and almost 6 for the sprint speed. So you're running fast with an LMG. You're not, you're not walking in slow motion here. Oh, there she is again. She's muppetizing. Shame to have to gack her, but Grandpa's the man to do. Ooh, what have we here? I think he was looking for... Whoop, I think he was looking for her, too. We're just going to shoot through cover there. I haven't had a test at distance yet. Whoa. Grandpa ate a few bullets, bought to farm. There's relative distance there. And as you can see, no recoil. One headshot after another. And we sent that guy to La La Land. There's another. Whoop. He ran away. Let's see if we can find him. Oh, tactical evening dress. And there's that guy looking. I don't think he was looking. And as I'm reloading, and it does reload okay pretty quickly for an LMG, especially one with 100 rounds. Grandpa buys the farm. See, the problem I have with time to kill, or not the problem, the issue, and the specific issue, issue is judging a weapon only by time to kill. There's a Muppet laying down there in front of the table. Is that often when you come up against an enemy, you may be hurt, they may be already be injured. So time to kill doesn't tell you how fast you're going to gack them. You're going to gack them a lot faster than that if you get the rounds into them. And a bullet that, or a bullet, a weapon that does fairly decent damage in a real life situation where enemies are often wounded, even though it may shoot slow, which this one does not. It's a fast shoot. Look at that. Whoa. And Grandpa got shot with the arrow and brought it right up next guy. Well, well, what do we do here? Boom, 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 boom. So, time to kill might keep you, if you judge your weapon only based on that, from selecting a weapon. There's the tactical cocktail wear Muppet lady. Is she there? Is she there? Uh, somebody's trying to Granado her. Oh. Should have picked that one up, but I don't know if, how cooked it was. There's range. And there's a gack. So be careful about judging everything on time to kill. <laughs> oh, see, on that that time, that guy was obviously already injured. Yeah, Grandpa's not going to dance this time. I know you probably made it this far because you want to see him do a little dance for you. But I'm going to tease you. Not going to do it. So the guy coming out the door, he was already hurt and only took a bullet or two. So the sprint to fire speed is what's important. It's 71 milliseconds here. ADS movement speed is important. All those things are important, not just time to kill. I mean, I, can't, I could go on forever about that, and I think the more experienced players might agree with me there. You might not. If you don't, put it down in the comments. I spawned into this match, I think it was 14 points down already, but decided to go ahead and give the tax stance a try because I knew I was going to get longer shots with it.
This weapon is a beast. It is an absolute beast. Do I think they'll nerf it? Maybe, but I mean, is there really enough time left to worry about it that much? Do I think it's meta? Yeah. It, depending on the category. I don't know. I'd almost rather be running around this with this than any other weapon, unless uh, you're a Pomage level quick scoper. You can fix <laughs> quick scope like Phase Kitty. If you can't, and you're on a medium to small map, even with long lanes, you are going to rule with this weapon. I'm just showing you some Gax here, basically. So, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Tell me your stories on the cast off LSW. I did get it to Interstellar. I'm ranking up the mastery camo, so I have forged on it. Like it and subscribe, and that helps me, helps the family. I'm trying to get the channel to the magic 5,000 number, and I'd appreciate any help I can get with that. And it's really amazing. I've met a lot of nice people. Anyway, cheers and peace to you.